Welcome to Discover Talent friends. I am your host Vinod. In this series, we are going to cover the option, the new option, okay, uh, option available in the PowerPoint called Rehearse with Coach, right? So this is in a very interactive option and Office 365, you know, come up with this particular functionality. If you are using some other MS Office version, it's, this particular option may not be there, but in Office 365, this is available. Okay, and it's a very cool function, folks. So, okay, uh, this is the video I've already uploaded on the YouTube. Uh, if you have missed this particular video series, uh, you can check that part. Okay, I've intentionally put this particular video uh, so we can, you know, work on this option called Rehearse with Coach. Correct, this option you will get into the slideshow and then option called Rehearse with Coach. Correct. So what exactly it does? Uh, it gives us a summary report. Okay, so what type of content added and uh, if we are using any kind of a profanity word, right, in this uh, particular slide, or maybe deck, or maybe presentation, right? So that's we can remove it. Okay, and if any kind of a slowness is there in particular slider, we can check the timelines as well. So you can check that particular glance uh, at the end. Okay, so I'll just quickly show you how it looks like. So when I click on that particular button, it asked me to start rehearsing. So I'll just do a test, test, test. I'll just do test. Perfect. And then it's listening to me, whatever I'm, you know, right now I'm explaining my part, just, just listening to me. And then it's okay, I'm done. So I'll just, okay. And then just do escape button. Okay, when you click on the escape, right, uh, you will get the summary report like this. And this is the very beautiful, you know, design by the with the help of AI functionality, right? Or maybe machine learning, we can say, right? So I'll quickly explain you each uh, fields what it is exactly, correct? So uh, the slider which I have currently, the only one slide. And the total time spent, uh, especially when we were doing the rehearsal, right? That time is so, no? total time spent, so and so minutes, right? Uh, summary reports, uh, keep up the hard work, right? It's saying that good work. I mean, the, there is a no any kind of enough profanity words I have used. Again, the profanity words you can uh, see over here as well, if there isn't any, right? Filters uh, to sound more polished, confident, try to avoid using a filter words. Correct. So this is giving us a machine learning uh, algorithm. It's back end, you know, it's running and it gives us an overview that, you know, where we need to improvise our sliders. Okay. So repetitive la language, if in case uh, we are using any repetitive language that uh, suppose I'm again and again promoting my brand like Discover Talent Presents, Discover Talent Presents. Okay. Then it will give me the another score. But here I haven't said anything by the time of rehearsing. Right. So that's the reason saying nice work. And then inclusiveness great job you can inclusive language most excellent so this is the basic basic ask and then pace uh, how many words we have used how many time particular words when we are using the words right for that particular minutes how many words we have used or maybe consumed right that particular uh, information we are getting in this particular dashboard and the you are uh, okay with it you can give the feedback as well to the microsoft team and they can you know improvise their machine learning algorithm at the back end